All right, you guys, I kind of just dropped his most recent album, Vultures 1, and I think it's pretty fire. But anyway, the vibes on that is immaculate. Like, the production is crazy, and today in this video, I feel like I'd be wrong again if we didn't make a beat in that sort of style. Of course, sure to go check out my Discord, man. Link in the description. If you guys aren't in it, then you're just missing out at this point. I'm lost pack Pac-Bone 2K is also out now as well. Both link in the description. And yeah, man, let's just get right into it. Starting off, man, this is the source to do it. So, obviously, um, majority of the album has, like, a nice little sort of gospel choir vibe because it's, it's been going for that recently. As you guys can see, I'm not in a church or anything right now. I don't have a gospel choir around me so i can't obviously do that so for the next thing i could do for that is of course go to spice and don't click off just hear me out okay this is some source anyway if you guys haven't checked this out already so if you're on spice this is literally the bank you guys need to make these kind of sort of style beats it's called the city choir volume 2 and all of these or majority of these samples anyway have these this very nice choir sound so you can hear like this has got that kind of sound so we're just gonna go through a few of these and try and see which one uh, we want. All right, so we might we might use two for this. So this would be where the beat is. This one we build we will build around this obviously, and then maybe for like an intro we could use like this. I feel like it just needs it needs that piano to go underneath it, man. So to do that, we want to go straight to contact, and this is also some source. Like Bank of One of Power is crazy for pianos. Like I mean, it pretty much sounds like an actual piano. Here it is. So yeah, this is what the piano is called. It's called SSS Vintage Upright Other Side. And yeah, as you guys can see, it's an upright piano. It sounds very realistic. So we're gonna build onto this with that piano. So I'm gonna gonna try and some kind of place some stuff in. So. Yeah, we're we'll gonna try and find like all the notes. Sounds really weird, but I can hear the notes more on key when it's with an 808 instead of like a piano or anything. I don't know why. Okay, that sounds pretty good to me. Now this is the piano, and now we have these root notes. Oh, my back kills, man. All right, anyway, so what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna get a new channel right now, and I'm gonna get literally, where is it? I'm just gonna get a sample channel, so obviously you can't hear anything, but it's gonna be used for new root notes. So now I can't hear anything, but now when I, whenever I go into the actual uh, piano roll, you can see these root notes, right? So I'm gonna use these for like, obviously reference, and I'm gonna bring these down a little bit so we can just use boards and stuff. So let's go to the sampler, bring this down, and now we can build some chords and build around this. Down oh, that chord is so nice. Maybe we should have this as a note. Oh, okay, okay. And now let's just do some more of these. So we have an F chord and then we have a C sharp chord. So let's bring this down. Let's make these chords. Bam, bam, bring down another octave. Knees both up, and then bring the mids up as well. What does that sound like? Okay. up to a G sharp. And let's do this D sharp up and up to the wall. Okay, it's nice. So now let's randomize this. Now let's do a bit of strum as well. That's, that's good. Okay, so now obviously what Kanye likes to do is he likes to just have vocals, but like the, 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 the choir is not always on the note, it's always been transposed like down, you know what I'm saying? Like he's got a lot of songs with a choir. It's just, you can hear it's been pitched down because you can hear it in the frequency. So we're gonna do that. So A sharp's a bit of an annoying key anyway. So let's bring it down to like F sharp. So one, two, three, down, four. And let, let's, let's see what that sounds like. Oh, really good. 
And obviously, I'm going to throw this through uh, my master channel because this is really going to help on this. Most of my videos, I go through master and I like to use this archetype Cory Wong, which pretty much makes it more mono. And because it it's literally a guitar amp, so it makes it more mono and you can play around the frequencies. And what I like to do is I boost the height. And let's say I put it in and it makes it more mono. It sounds a little bit more like a sample. So just listen. Know what I'm saying? A little virtual mix track on there as well. I want it. I want it to pretty highly compress. I'm also gonna get. Um, I haven't used this in a while actually, but I'm gonna get the uh, good hertz well control plugin right here. All right, that's that 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 that's a pretty solid start. I can't even lie. So now I want to go to contact again. I feel like I don't even need no other plugins, man. Contact is literally the best plugin you can get. I'm just say it right now. I want to go to contact. I'm gonna get this uh, Scarby Rickenbacker bass. I'm trying to go underneath it, and this is this is starting off quite well. So I'm gonna start off by going to the, the night session. I'm gonna make it just follow those root notes and just add a little bit of bounce. So first off, I'm gonna make it just follow the notes normally, and then we're gonna add some bounce after. So these are the root notes, obviously, from what we got before. There. If you heard like old sort of soul music and stuff like that, bass kind of has a little sort of sound that bum bum bum. Because obviously someone playing the bass, and you, you know what I'm saying? They're free sound a little. Bit. as well because you know it's actually being played out okay so now i'm hearing some sort of pads in the background so pads we're gonna go straight to atmosphere we might even get like a sort of piano pad just to really go over it because obviously we're thinking like some sort of old-fashioned gospel choir and stuff and like what do they have in churches you know what i'm saying they don't have these they don't have atmosphere in the church so we're gonna go to um the keyscape library and we're gonna try and get like a little keyboard sound and we want to get one like maybe yeah like a bell tone one something which they'll probably be using so yeah so this could be like a pad or something we just take away some of the highs Man, we need to just put some little sauce on the top. So for the sauce, man, I'm gonna get some little phrases on here. I wanna get some phrases from a kit that isn't even out yet. It's not like this could be pretty good. Maybe if it's on key. It's like this at the end can be nice. But obviously, man, Kanye, with these sort of things, he likes to use some sort of boom bap style drum. So we're gonna add to that. We're gonna try and do that right now. Have a nice little bounce. So obviously got a little boom bap folder, you know what I'm saying? I like, love maybe boom bap something here and there, here and there. So now we need some nice little hats to go underneath that. Oh. Okay, so now we want to get the intro as well. So obviously, as I was saying before, we're going to get spliced and try and find a little sample intro. Maybe this one. I think it's gonna be this one. This is this is screaming Kanye for me, and it's G sharp major, which is really annoying. So let's try and find what key actually is. Like, what is G sharp major? Mirror, 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 minor. Moves are through. Coming for me right now. Mine. E minor. It's G major. What the hell? E sharp. That's not even what E sharp. F minor. And that's in. Oh, it was one off. We need to add to this a little bit. Lord, prepare me. Sound like. Lord, prepare me. Oh my god, that actually works. That was, that was I, I am confused. Let me start in between. Are we going to use the same vocal? Yes, we are. Why does it work with everything? This flipping vocal, bro. Because that actually works. <laughs> we need to do like a little reverb intro right here. We get loads of reverb. And so to do this, obviously, you just want to get Lord. And then just have that tail. So I'm just going to explore that out. Got that tail on it. Reverb. Now we have a little um, reverse thing right here. So we just reverse it. And then hearing it on its own should sound pretty. Yeah, sick. sweet. Hold on. At 
this point, the uh, sub base comes in. So what we we'll do is we're literally gonna get this, um, where is it? This contact right here, control C. And then we're gonna go to Lost Pack Volume 1 jump kit. This is what I've been using recently, man, for this, for, for the synth base, for the sub base, not synth base. Uh, we got a sub base from there. Now we should do control V. Obviously we're gonna bring it up a little bit. All right, man, I think the beat's there. So this is, this is, yeah, this is what we got. Hope you guys enjoyed. Catch you on the next one. Peace.